With all this that's going on, we know a lot of injustices are happening. And we serve a God of justice and he will get justice. But again, I will tell you, it has to be this way. All of you who are even joining in with Black Lives Matter, they are using a slogan because we're going to say Black Lives Don't Matter. They're using a slogan and other people's oppression and hurt to push their agenda. You need to go to their website and read their manifesto and they are with abortion, they are with feminism. They said they are not for the family, period, patriot family, and you have agreed with that. They use the slogan that nobody can say, how can you say not black life don't matter? And you're coming into agreement with that and I'm telling you, you, the food of it going to hit your house. They are using the slogan and the pain of a people who are the Negro people to push their agenda. And it has nothing to do with the life of uh, the, 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 the lives of blacks. It has nothing to do with it. You have got to do your homework and quit jumping on the bandwagon because I'm going to say again, the Lord is not in this noise. He is not in those crowds. He is not in the riots. He is in the still, in, in the prayer closet, praying and speaking through a still small voice and out of your heart.